Hello friends, Andrew Demeter here today with a chiropractor chatbot template for you. So I'm gonna click get started here to begin. Obviously this is designed specifically for chiropractors, but also for marketing agencies who are running different campaigns on social media for these practices. So right here in the onboarding, we give a branded logo of the chiropractor practice, the office. And then we also show this one liner explaining what it is exactly that these doctors do. Of course, all this imagery and copy is fully customizable to fit your needs, all easy drag and drop stuff. But let's go ahead here to the main menu where users will see an option list of what they can do in this spot. So first say that we are a new patient, right? We have back pain, for example, we've never been to the practice before. We can click here to get started and see exactly what this process actually looks like. Of course, this is a perfect strategy for generating leads within this messenger experience. So it's going to say, hey, we offer complimentary free consultations to new patients. Just enter some basic information here. So I'm going to say book consultation, click this button right here. Once I do that, it's going to prompt me to share some personal details. I'll enter my email, just a fictitious one, a at a.com. I'll do that. It'll ask to confirm it. I'll say, yep, looks good. Alternatively, if I mistype something, I can change that right here. And then I'll enter in a fictitious phone number, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, oh, I enter that. And then the final question here is going to be, you know, what are you coming in for essentially? What is your specific physical issue? So I'll say that I'm having poor posture. I'll click that. And now at this point, this lead has been fully captured within the bot. It gets sent to the practice via email so they can follow up and it's frictionless for the user as well. So again, a great strategy for generating leads right here within the bot itself. Also at the end of this, if you want, you can include a call to action such as download a PDF, something that has a patient intake form, for example, where they can fill that out and then bring it into the consult as well. Now, one thing that I wanna show you before I go to the appointment part of this bot is I wanna type in abandon here. So this is the message that will get sent to users if they don't actually make it all the way through this complimentary consultation lead form. Of course, the end goal here is to get more patients walking through the doors. And so this is a follow-up mechanism, sort of a reminder to say, hey, you started this consultation form, but you didn't finish it. Are you sure you want to sort of leave it at that? Or do you want to go through and actually come in for that consult for your specific type of pain? So again, this message is fully customizable. Users won't obviously type in abandon. This happens in the background. It'll get sent one day after they start, but don't complete that form. But that's how it works. It's intended to increase conversions at the end of the day. Now let's skip ahead to services, for example. Obviously in this section, we can see the full comprehensive list of services and then schedule an appointment as well. So let's say again that I have back pain, but maybe I'm an existing patient, so I don't go to the new patient section. I click here to book an appointment, and now you'll see coming into play something that I refer to as contextual lead forms. So previously, even though traditionally part of this form is asking for the user's email and phone number, since I've previously entered that in the bot, it's just gonna skip right ahead. It's not gonna repeatedly ask me those same questions that I've already provided the answers for. So now I simply click here to schedule an appointment date and time. I'll do that, let's say February, 5th on Monday, for example, at say 4.15 p.m. Looks good. So I'm going to click done. And just like before, it's that easy to schedule an appointment right within Facebook Messenger in this chiropractor bot. Super simple for everyone involved. That lead info gets sent to the practice via email. Now, another thing that I want to show you is if I type in review here, again, just a demonstrational command. Users don't type this. This message will get sent to the user seven days, one week after their actual appointment. So obviously you just saw me schedule an appointment for February 5th. So on February 12th, I will get this message as the user, basically following up and saying, hey, how was the appointment, right? And hopefully if you're a good chiropractor practice, you can then get more reviews, boost your Google SEO, boost your Yelp reviews, for example, by including this strategic call to action of leave of review, right? Other things that I wanna show you in this bot are testimonials, for example. So this is a section that helps you as a practice establish social proof, which is extremely important, right? You need your patients and prospects to trust you before they're gonna give you money. Let's say that I am a male, maybe Tyler relates to me most. So I click here, I can watch Tyler's video. Obviously all these are just placeholder images you can replace them with actual content. And now we get this video of, you know, Tyler hypothetically talking about the practice, how great it is to sort of persuade me to come over and become a patient, right? 
And then we also have this call to action again to schedule a complimentary consultation. So if I'm at this part of the bot because I'm a little skeptical about the practice, I need to build that trust. It gives me the value add right here to schedule that free appointment and sort of break down that barrier between the customer and the practice. So other things that I wanna show you, let's type in, uh, for example, what's your address? So this is showing the natural language processing, the built-in NLP in the bot, which allows users to type in questions free form, just as if they were talking to one of their friends and get meaningful instantaneous answers right within the bot. So this is a great example. You know, it says, hey, here's our address. If I want, I can click to even get directions. And based on my current GPS location, it'll give me step-by-step -step directions via Google Maps to the practice. So really simplifying the user experience and providing that instantaneous, immediate customer support that they so desperately need. So that's that. I'll say, for example, what's your phone number? Notice, of course, I'm typing in completely broken English just to prove the robustness and power of this natural language processing. So I can type in that. I can also type in something like, uh, I'd like to see your customer reviews if I type it correctly. And once I do that, it's gonna take me to the section that we were just at where we have that social proof, basically speaking good of the practice in question. Now, one more thing that I wanna show you as well is the about us, going back to social proof, building trust, building loyalty among patients. This is somewhere else, again, accessible through the main menu that users can go if they wanna learn more about the doctors themselves. So for example, say I'm interested in John Doe, I can click here to read his bio. And once I do that, it's gonna give some basic information about him. If I'm interested, I can click read more here. And again, it'll provide me this timely and well-placed call to action where I can click to book a consultation to become a lead, eventually a patient walking through the door. So this is really the chiropractor chatbot template here in a nutshell. Just to recap the key features, the main value adds here, right off the bat, we have that free consultation lead magnet. We have a follow-up on that as well. So if users don't actually complete that form, we follow up with them saying, hey, are you sure you don't want to do this? And basically make you feel better at the end of the day. Are you sure you don't want to do that. In addition to that, we have the contextual lead form. So we're not repeatedly asking the user the same information that they've previously provided. On top of that, we give them the ability to write within the bot schedule an appointment and also follow up seven days after that appointment saying, hey, would you like to leave a review of your experience to help boost our credibility on other platforms outside of Facebook? And then finally, in addition to that, you have the bios and testimonials of the chiropractor practice, the office to build that credibility and customer loyalty. And then finally, you have the five to seven NLP intense or frequently asked questions that users can ask the bot and get those meaningful answers, such as, you know, what's your phone number? Where's your office located? I'd like to schedule an appointment, see customer reviews, all that sort of basic stuff and provide an immediate, instantaneous, and hopefully meaningful response to them. So again, this has been the chiropractor chatbot template. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, be sure to ask them. Other than that, take care.